Hello, I'm Josh Pollison, and welcome to Your Story Now. Today we're going to look at range of interpretation for another sense. In this case, we are going to look at our sense of sound. So let's look at an example. Bob, get out of the toilet! Susie yelled at her friend. He thought, just because he was older, he could do whatever he wanted. Well, he couldn't. Susie, can't you see? I dropped my dentures in there! So in this case, we have a pretty close range of interpretation. Now, is it one? Eh, this is debatable, because after all, things are cartoonized, they are simplified. This might be a representation of the story's world. And also, odds are we have extra noise that has not been inserted. So the narrator is explaining visual, but the narrator is not actually audio that we're hearing, so he's not really relevant. The voices, though, and the sound effects are, and you can kind of tell that they're exaggerated, which could be perceived as, again, maybe it's exaggerated so that we can interpret how it actually sounds, so that there's emphasis on it, so that we can actually hear it and understand it. If that's the way that the world really sounds, then we have one potential interpretation. Otherwise, though, we have many, because you could say, well, how exactly does it sound in their world? Maybe Bob doesn't sound quite that silly. Maybe Susie doesn't sound quite that silly. Maybe it's all just exaggerated for the purpose of storytelling. So you have a potentially somewhat open range of interpretation, or it could be completely closed. So you just have one potential interpretation. Now let's look back at Baby Goat. I want a baby goat at the petting zoo raffle. Goat, goat! Try to make sure it doesn't take over the world. Goat! We talked about this in the first video on range of interpretation. So there's actually a very wide range of interpretation because we're given the text, so we do have some information. We have the words that they are saying, but we don't actually know the voices. That's up to you and your interpretation. Yes, I read it, but ignoring my voice, there's a wide range of interpretation of voices here. Now let's look back at that photograph. What's the sound here? Likely there's happiness. You can maybe hear some outdoor noises like birds chirping, etc. So we have a pretty wide range of interpretation for sound as well with the photograph. So this allows us to describe and to compare and contrast the range of interpretation for sound in any medium.